And Hannah Simova uh, was the first person to sign up for my Patreon art school. And I said to her, what would you like me to do? And she said, draw a peony flower. So this is my first version and I'm not happy with it. <laughs> so, and while I was doing it, I thought I should do it again. And so I've done it again. I'm much more happy. And you can see that video if you join my art school. But while I was doing it, I thought, how would I do it if it was a cartoon version? I did this very quick little sketch. And, and I thought, I, that's what I'm gonna do now. Cause that's my kind of illustrating style. And so I'm gonna have a very quick go at having, doing something like that. So it kind of looks like a, a circle, but it's not really, it's really a kind of a, an ellipse. And there's a kind of a, um, a ring like that. And then the center is sort of somewhere up about there. And so this ring here is where these bits are really kind of looking, the petals are coming straight at you here. And they're really, really quite hard to draw. <laughs> and here, so then they're a bit more shallow. And then again, here they're, they're kind of curling around a lot here. And then you've got this kind of pattern where they're kind of overlapping like that. But they're not quite, I'm just doing this very roughly because I'm gonna ink, ink this in a moment. And there'll be some more like that. And then here it's kind of, they're quite <laughs> complicated shapes. And and you gotta make a, a kind of a hole in the middle there as well. And then there's going to be kind of petals coming like that and there. Interesting, uh, petals, I mean leaves. The leaves are really quite interesting in themselves. So these will kind of go off in three directions. Uh, and they'll be, oop, they're going kind of that way and then that way. <laughs> that way, that way. And they, they kind of cut cut on themselves as well. So, so there'll be that little bit there. And again, this is gonna come here. It's gonna swing out. And they're kind of, you have these little cuts there. And then also they will curl around. <coughs> and Something, something like that. And I'm gonna need another one coming down here, which is gonna be something like that. There's something quite flame-like about the, the pattern here, which is giving me ideas for uh, next month's assignment on the <laughs> on the art school, which you're gonna to have to be a member to find out about that. <laughs> and so I've got to do the, the, the vase. As I was hanging out with some members of the art school yesterday, having a chat. So we were talking about whether it's a vase or a vase. And I say vase, and I think in America you will say vase or vase. So now I'm going to see what I can do. So this is going to be very much a cartoony kind of thing. And so I'm going to draw in these. These are the kind of outlines of the thing. So these are quite soft in a way. And then, and here, this is kind of where, because they're sort of head on towards you, you're looking directly on the edge of the petal. You're seeing the, the kind of the folds uh, uh, as they fold over and curl over into the thing. And then, here, um, I'm just going to do some more coming kind of like that, and then we're going to want to get this kind of. It gets quite ragged. The petals get quite ragged in the middle, and so it's quite chrysanthemum-like actually as, as well, isn't it? In a way. Uh, so I'm kind of thinking like that, and then we want this dark kind of hole. And then it's just a question of going around this leaf. And 
there. Now I'm going to put a horizon line there. Uh, that's how you draw stuff with really. a bit of shadow to put it on the table. And I'm going to just going to put a little bit of sort of ink work in here just to give it a hint of sort of shadow and a hint of it being pen and ink, although it's probably not necessary. And I'm going to put a little bit of pen and ink shadow down this side of the, the vase. And maybe a bit of shadow under there. And maybe a little bit under there too. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. And if you want to go and see how to paint this picture, then uh, click the link and off you go. Or just try the mystery drawing. Either way, make sure you click the Sue Rader Drawing logo and subscribe for lots more drawing videos on YouTube. And why not go over to patreon.com uh, where you can support me, get step-by-step -step sheets to join my art school, do lots and lots of stuff. Uh, in the meantime, keep drawing, drawing, drawing. Practice, practice, practice. And I'll see you next time. You take care now. Bye-bye.